Hey guys, my name is Chris with Layjax Media. Uh, we are a company that does all kinds of stuff with videos and as we was researching here recently we did find a new tool uh, we want to share with you. It's called Movavi Screen Capture Studio and this tool allows you to screen capture images as well as video, create your own videos, uh, record video games online, uh, or even record video from the internet from web pages and I want to show you how that is done. But to take it a step further, they also they also give you the option to convert that video as well as edit it, where you can add some really neat little transitions, fades, and uh, and do some really cool stuff. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Now you can download a free trial of the Movalvi Screen Capture Studio uh, through the link there on your screen, or you can click the link that's under this video in the about section. It's movtrials.com forward slash capture. And when you visit that link, it's going to take you to the download page uh, so we can download a free trial of this software and follow along with me. Now, there are some restrictions with this software. Um, with, the, with the trial version, you do get seven days uh, to use it. And with the seven day trial, it also puts a watermark in the video after it's been recorded and also only records up to two minutes. So if it's something you like, I highly recommend you go ahead and purchase it. It is only a fraction of the cost of what some of these more expensive tools are. In fact, one of our more recent tools that we purchased cost over $300. And the Movavi Screen Capture Studio does many of the same things as it does. And it's only a fraction of the cost. So once you download and install the tool and run it, this is what you're going to see. You're going to see a red box. And what this red box is, is this is what it's going to record or take a picture of down here are your settings you can choose the size of the area you want to record let me go ahead and drag this up so you can see all these settings you can see here you can choose from standard or widescreen full screen or custom setting um, you can also click the select button and the select button will automatically find areas to record on your screen and highlight them for you uh, very good for especially if you want to record like a YouTube video or some other video on your screen it'll automatically select the area to record makes it really fast and convenient you can choose to record the audio you can record the sound coming from your speakers or you can choose to record the microphone sound uh, so if you're recording a video online you want to make sure you choose the speakers and basically it'll record the audio that's coming uh, through your computer from that video and it, and it records it very well up here are some options for your capture, uh, for the audio, for effects, additional tools you can download from Movavi, as well as information on on uh, how to do certain things through the tutorials, buy, activate the software, and get updates. So what we want to do, I want to go ahead and open up the browser. I've got a YouTube video picked out, and we're going to go ahead and record some. I want to show you exactly how it works. So if you haven't watched this video yet, it is quite funny. So let me go ahead and I'm going to move the screen down and let's say I just want to record this video and keep it. Now as you've seen I did, you know, I moved the screen over here so I can highlight the box but if you don't want to do that you can click select and this is where it'll come up and it'll pick different areas of the screen automatically and you can see the blue line bouncing there. If I click it it's automatically going to lock in on that video so it's ready to record. So what I can do from here is I can go ahead and click record. And it's just reminding me I've got a seven day trial and what the restrictions are. Okay, here it's telling me it's about ready to start. And I'm gonna click play on the video. And I'm just gonna record just a few minutes of this video. I'm not gonna to record too much of it, just to give you an idea of what can be done with it. Let's jump ahead here a little bit. All right, let's go ahead and pause the video and I'll stop the recording. And now we have a new screen. Let me minimize this and you can see now, uh, this is the video that we just recorded and we can go ahead and watch it again just to see, um, you, you, can, you can see the quality is really good on it. And then from here, we can convert the video to different options. And then there are additional settings here. If you click this button, and then you can share it, you can convert it, delete it, but what we want to do is edit the video. So I'm going to click on the edit button, it's going to open up the video editor. 
and we'll minimize this screen and you can see here here's our video and the video has been added here in our little um, section what we want to do is take it and drop it down to the timeline and then you can see that uh, the video down here you can use the button over here to zoom out or to zoom in if you need to get uh, more precise on adding things to your video and from here what we want to do is we can either add other types of video or media to it and kind of piece it together we can add media files DVDs 3d you can capture more videos you can capture through your webcam or record audio or just all kinds of stuff you can do uh, here's the media files that's already that you've already recorded we can add effects to the video and there's all kinds of effects I'm not going to go through all these and show them to you like I said you can download the free trial and you can uh, go through here and check them all out yourself but there are some really neat effects and there's just so much you can do with this tool there's also a lot of fades if you want to split your video or add different kinds of fades or transitions in between slides let me give you an example let's um let's go about to this point and we'll split the video into two and then let's add a fade here okay and you kind of see how that faded in. There's all different kinds you can do here. As you mouse over, you can see the options that are available. And now there's also titles you can use. Oops, let me pause the video. Uh, if you go to titles, uh, let's see here. If you click on them, it'll show you where the title will appear at or, or what it'll do. It's like flying words. Let's use that one. We'll go to settings and type in this is a video about. Uh, roller coaster ride okay and let's and we'll just keep it there and then you can you can change different settings I want it the animation the speed I want it to be a lot faster than what it was you can add shadows to it but we're gonna leave it like that make this a box a little bit bigger and then we're gonna add it to the beginning of the video you can see it added it here and so let's go ahead and play it and see what it looks like and there you have it and it goes right into it now what we can do is we can add a transition between the title and this uh, to make it look better so it's not just jumping directly from uh, the title into the video so we can go to back to our fades and we can choose um, we'll do something like this here and let's play it again and there you can see it kind of fade out and fade into the video and so there's all different kinds of things you can do with this tool. It's 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 not just a really good tool, but it's a fun tool. Uh, there's just so much you can do with it. And then once you're done, you can save your video. And then when you save it, you can share it online. Uh, they have their own little tools so where it allows you to uh, share the video through your social sites, automatically upload it to YouTube. Just a lot of different things you can do with it. And I, I, I do highly recommend it, especially for people who likes to save video for themselves and just want to record clips and um, uh, you know just to have them on their computer to watch later uh, if you want to record your video games if you want to record you know through your webcam and just tutorials just whatever it is if you want to record something off your computer or on your computer and then be able to share it also or just keep it for yourself this is an excellent tool to do that with and so like I said you can download that free trial through MOV uh, trials dot com forward slash capture and I put that link under the video click it it'll take you there download the trial check it out yourself and see what you think and then visit the site um, to see if they are offering discounts lots of times they offer really good discounts on the software if you go to um, on the software if you go to help and click buy now lots of times they'll offer 30 40 percent discount like right now you can see where you can get it for 40 percent off so a really good deal for only 49 dollars considering that we spent over 300 on our last uh, tool that we bought that does many of the similar things so there you have it i hope you guys enjoyed this review i do highly recommend the tool it works very well